Hello there, uh, this is a, another video in regards to pen testing. This time this video is going to be related around um, changing the user agent to something different, which is quite standard, everybody knows how to do that. But what you can also do is that you can change the user agent to have script commands. And by doing so, you can run and inject different forms of um, injection into a page and make it do something that was, it wasn't designed to do. So, we have this example here. We have our OWSP, um, security level zero, um, hints are on, and we're logged in as a user, which doesn't matter. You can be logged in, not logged in. So we see at the bottom here, we can see the current browser is set is to my browser, which happens to be um, Ice Weasel in Debian Jesse. So we see Mozilla Firefox and PHP version, very nice. Okay, so that's the user agent that we've currently got. It's just displaying what the browser is. So what we can do is change our uh, user agent to display a message box so if we change the user agent from this string here to something like this script alert and then in parentheses put in something like YouTube and then close the script tag off yeah, change these if you like do whatever we want with them Okay, that now what will happen is that when we refresh the page it will run that script and open a message box and display the text YouTube okay it doesn't seem to have done that yet Let's just try it Again. Ah, okay, so it hasn't. We haven't switched the user agent. We just edited it and saved it. So that's all that was. So, XSS message box. Hit enter, and there we go. So we've told it to execute the command to open a message box and display the word YouTube. So that's very interesting. Now. In, in later videos, I'm going to show how we can go into more in depth into that, how we can play around with it. Just to show that that style works in the second security level, we can go to level one. Of course, it's going to run again because it's going to run every single time. Security level one, try slightly harder, and it still works. Now, if we put the security level to level five. Now we have server and client side security. Scripts are not allowed to run and therefore it won't work. So if we try and run it this time, it doesn't do anything. Look at the bottom and we can see our browser is set to what we'd expect it to say, but yet the text hasn't run. So I hope that was useful and interesting. Small things like this can help uh, using visual aids to try and understand different concepts of what you can achieve. Thanks very much for watching.